Okay, let's talk about the food. My favorite food would be, um, well, I have a couple of favorite dishes. I love tacos, tacos de carne asada, and I love pozole, um, chicken pozole. And I know that a lot of people usually eat that, you know, the, with beef um, or pork, but um, the chicken pozole is really good. It's green and it's spicy, and my mom makes that um, for every Christmas, every year. It's like a tradition of hers. So chile rellenos, arroz verde, mole con pollo, those are just some of my top favorites. Um, the mole, you can use that pretty much on anything. You can make some really good enchiladas out of it. Another good breakfast food too is nopales con huevo on corn tortillas. Oh, those are so good. So, uh, thinking back about my grandmother when we were young, she used to make enchiladas and that was a really special time. She only made them like on our birthday or when it was like a holiday, but um, every so often she would bring it out like on a Tuesday and everybody, no matter where they were, would always come and eat because they were so special and we would always try to outdo each other and see how many we could always eat and we always love to eat. The ilotes, the corn, and I know it's like all the rage right now, the corns, different hot Cheeto corns and different types of corns, but um, when I was growing up there was always people selling corn. They would just come um, on the neighborhood and then they would sell corn to you. So um, that was something that I was used to um, before all these, you know, people are out with these different types of corn recipes. Um, we just would go to the, um, the person selling on the cart with either tamales or corn. Um, one of my favorite things to eat is actually pretty unique, but it reminds me of my heritage and my mom making pozole. Um, but I do enjoy eating pickled pig's feet. It's something that is an acquired taste, but it really brings me back to my roots. And I do also enjoy eating street tacos, especially tacos de tripa or chorizo.